Well, they did it again. A lightsaber to the chest. And once again, the person didn't die. Really? Sabine gets a lightsaber to the chest. And he doesn't take her out. Like, what is even the point anymore? Can Dave Filoni's characters even be killed? Like, does he just give them infinite plot armor? It's really frustrating. I mean, when you have George Lucas's Star Wars, treat lightsabers not as a joke, but very serious. Um, wounds get cauterized. Uh, you know, a, a lightsaber to the chest, you know, took out Qui-Gon Jinn. Um, the, and some people were trying to argue, oh, it's actually just because um, it didn't hit anything vital. It's like, it's superheated plasma. And yes, I know there was a video where they actually broke down the real life science of it, but that doesn't really matter. I'm just saying from the continuity of this. <sighs> Lightsaber usually cauterizes anything because it's super hot. And if it hits a chest, you wouldn't just be able to walk away from it like it was nothing. Um, you'd be down for a while if you managed to survive, and you probably would have to have cybernetics uh, put in to be take, you know, to take care of you. Um, I hate it. I'm so done with Disney Star Wars. Like, I can't, I cannot stand how terrible it is. Um, on the flip side, Netflix released another couple of photos from the One Piece show that's coming out in a, about a week, and, uh, oh yeah, a lot of talk on the internet is that they're absolutely horrifying looking, and I'm like, what did you think snail phones were going to look like in real life? Yeah, in the cartoon, well, in the anime, they don't look that intense. But you're trying to turn them into real life. Um, a giant snail with a face that mimics your words as you're talking would probably definitely look pretty horrifying. So this doesn't actually bother me. The Den Den Mushis actually look pretty, you know, pretty good. They probably won't look as scary when they're in movement because it's going to be really goofy that, that they're copying whoever's talking into them. Um, but yeah, I, I am looking forward to watching this show. Uh, it might not be good, but I think I'm going to at least at the bottom line be able to enjoy it. 